Hey friends, I just wanted to take a minute and uh, share my thoughts with you. I figured it was easier to make a little video since I have the technology here on my laptop to do it uh, instead of typing it out. Um, I just like you am disheartened about what has happened. I'm not surprised at all, to be very honest with you. I thought it was possible. I certainly hoped uh, that it wasn't become a reality, but it has. So what do we do now? Um, you know, previously in a post I talked about uh, back in the days when I was uh, had my, my hand at boxing for a bit, I was never a great boxer. I, I was a tough boxer. I was a fighter. I was too short for my weight category as a super heavyweight and heavyweight. Uh, I had short arms and I often showed up at fights looking at the other guys who were taller and uh, had longer arms and uh, longer and faster strides than me and I, I doubted myself and so I've been in positions before where I started at the bottom. When I was in those positions I said you know what I'm here. I'm here to fight. I came to fight. I can fight whether I'm going to win or not I have no idea. But I'm here, I'm not going to fight. Uh, I believe the same thing about where we're at right now. Uh, I'm here to fight for my firearms rights because I believe they are intrinsically a right that should exist for me. I demand them. I will fight for them regardless who's in power, regardless if it's a liberal anti-gun majority, which I'm not quite sure how anti-gun they are yet. We're going to find out or whether it's a, a more pro-gun government. I'm not going to stop fighting for my rights. And firearms, as I've shared previously, are representative and uh, intrinsically attached with other rights, I believe, such as freedom of speech, self-defense rights, and property rights. So I just encourage you all. Uh, we're all in the same boat together. It's really shitty. There's no doubt. Uh, I'm not going to say it any differently but it is what it is it doesn't change a thing about why I'm going to fight for what I believe and I, I want to do it with you to conclude my moment of just sharing what I think with you for what it's worth one area that I believe firearms organizations and firearms enthusiasts enthusiasts need to band together on is this especially now, is we need to create a legal defense fund. It can't be about anything but defending those of us that might get ourselves in trouble standing up for our rights. That is where we need to show force. We need to show that we're united. We need to show that we stand with each other and put aside our petty differences. Some of us may believe in licensing. Some of us may believe in certification. Some of us may believe in no laws. And we can debate about those things. But if we can't stand united on the very thing that we're there fighting about, then we're, you know what, we should laugh at one another because that's all we're really worthy of is just laughing at each other because we're useless. We're just a sounding gong that makes noise and accomplishes nothing. So I just really encourage you. I'm a nobody. I'm just Steve. I love guns and I love my rights. I love my family and I would, I would, I would, I, I try daily to sacrifice myself working hard and providing for them. I care about you guys as people that obviously care about their rights too. And I really want to stand together with you. And, and make a difference. And there's been too much fighting. I really hope somehow, like, like many of you, that the NFA and the CSSA, and somehow we can all maybe be different, but join together and accomplish something powerful together. So from here on in, we know who our real enemy is. They've, they've, they've communicated that they're our enemy. They've communicated that they're going to infringe on our rights without any evidence, without any statistics, without any basis to do so. They want to take away from us. We know who our enemy is. So stop kicking the shit out of one another. Maybe we needed to learn this lesson. Stop berating 
beating on one another. And let's lock arms like we never have before and be a force to reckon with. I'm in. I got to do the same thing. I got to practice what I preach. Sometimes I get frustrated. I'm in. A hundred percent. And I hope you are too. Thanks for listening to my rant.